sporting brand new NDP branded locally made parkas. Nunavut MP Mumilak Kakak and NDP leader Jugmeet Singh stopped by a local coffee shop to meet the voters first hand Saturday morning. Friday had been spent meeting with the Inuit organizations and the government of Nunavut. This, this looked like more fun. It was Singh's first visit to Canada's youngest territory. From Friday to Sunday, the leader and his rookie MP pressed the flesh, posed for selfies, and generally enjoyed a victory lap around the capital. Sunday morning brought a visit to the Akaluit Soup Kitchen, where they got to see Nunavut's hunger problems firsthand. They also took questions from reporters. We wanted to know from Singh, just what did he learn during his weekend in Akaluit? It's one thing to hear the stories, it's one thing to hear someone explain something to you versus to go there and experience it. It's just always a much more powerful experience when you uh, hear those stories directly and you see what's happening directly. As for Kakak, she's been on the job for about a month now and was just named Northern Affairs Critic in the NDP Shadow Cabinet. We wanted to know what she's learned in her first month. Uh, understanding more the procedural side, more the policy side, where we have um, certain steps that we need to take in order for us to, to get the ball rolling, if you will. Uh, I think as well, wrapping my head around the realization that I will be up here half the time and I will be down south in Ottawa half the time is something that I've been really adjusting to as well. One of those policies, the NDP will be putting forward a new bill with some old targets and a very successful name attached. Singh explains. We'll be introducing Jack, a bill based on, inspired by Jack Layton's 2008 bill. This bill will put in place science-based targets, accountability to reach those targets, to make sure that fighting the climate crisis is a part of the law. From there, the two serve Sunday lunch at the soup kitchen. Seven out of ten Nunavut Inuit kids don't always know where their next meal is coming from. 25% of them regularly. The next time the NDP leader sees those numbers, he'll be able to attach them to a face. Kent Driscoll, APTN National News.